yeah, we hit it off straight away, didn't we? We had a, a giggle right from the start. Make sure every support session we have a laugh, eh? Yeah. So it doesn't matter if you had a rubbish day at college, Holland always made it a lot better. We would go shopping together, going for a coffee, being there as somebody that they can chat to, listening to them, hearing what they're saying. When I got part of the Rock Trust, I was in a shared accommodation. So that was like doing like your own cooking and washing and keeping it all tidy and I felt a lot better than what my situation was to begin with. Um, I felt safe. From shared to then moving into a single flat, you know, to see these sort of journeys, you know, this journey as, you know, stepping stones to, to eventually having your own flat. We used to have a laugh about your One Direction posters. And <laughs> It was nice for me to be able to see that you were putting your mark on the place. Your confidence was slowly starting to build. I think we were working with Colin and things like that. He was like, why don't you try this? Or have a look for volunteer shopping, have a wee bit more things to do. I was like, no, it's not my sort of thing. Or even going to meetings or that, Colin would always go with me because I didn't know like how we get there or we'd be too anxiety or anything sort of that. But confidence came after all the times we threw the Rock Trust. You'd said that you were thinking about working in shops. I'd suggested volunteer work. I knew one day Colin's not going to be around forever. So it was about time for me to step up on one two feet and actually go and do something myself. I think if I never went, like started volunteering, I wouldn't have been as confident as I was. But yeah, it's made me become a lot better person.